Well, good day, people of the internet. My name is Kiwi, and today I'm going to show you my bank robbery system on CERP. What's special about this bank robbery system is that there are two ways of robbing a bank. You either go in guns blazing, or you go do something special. I'll show you in this video. Let's first of all try to robbing uh, tr bleh, try to rob the bank just going in armed guns blazing. Uh, what you just do, you get in and you type slash rob bank. You need to hold a weapon. Um, if you don't hold a weapon, it'll tell you that you need to hold a weapon in order to do so, and you'll see. What happens is you need to wait 15 seconds if you try to rob the bank again. The bank will, of course, say, well, it's already been trying, uh, somebody already tried to rob it, and of course, the bank has a cooldown. Um, I failed to rob the bank. As you see, the shutter goes down. Uh, in chat, it says you failed to rob the bank, and you, of course, hear the bells ringing. Um... What you now do as a criminal, of course, you run off because the PD did get a uh, get a response that the bank is being robbed. So what you're probably going to do is going to run off. What's special about that, if the bank has been empty after a robbery for 30 seconds, um, something special will happen. But let's first adhere to the bell. Uh, the bell is also outside. Everybody outside will have the bell as well. And if you're not in the radius of the bank, the bell will shut off. And if you then get back into the radius... The bell is back again. Um, the bell will go for 60 seconds. Or if the bank closes after being robbed. Which will probably happen within a few seconds. As you see. Uh, Mr. Jim Bob Jr. spawns here. And the bank is now closed. Um, because well if a bank gets robbed normally they close down. Um, and Jim Bob Jr. will eventually in. Right now it's set to 60 seconds. Just for my, my scripting wise. So I can just try it out and everything. But in the future, when the server's up and running, it will be for something like 10 minutes. So the bank will be closed for 10 minutes. Nobody will be able to use it. And after the 10 minutes, it will just open again. And everything will be fine and dandy. Uh, I'll show you um, when the bank opens again. Um, I'll just fast forward to where Jim disappears again. And then we'll go back in. And then you'll see that everything works fine again. All right, we're back. As you saw, Jim is now gone and everything in the bank is back. The shutter is back up and the people in the bank are nice and chill again. If you try slash rob bank again, it will, of course, not work. The bank has a one hour cooldown, so it can only be robbed once an hour or after a server restart. So uh, people won't just continue robbing the bank, of course. Um, the next thing I'm going to show you is uh, what happens if you succeed the bank robbery. Uh, so what this is me going to do, because you only have a 25% chance that it actually succeeds by robbing the bank. So what I'm going to do is just reset the bank and rob it and rob it and rob it until uh, it, it actually happens. And then you'll see what happens. Let's just let me do this and I'll be back with you guys in a bit. Oh, there we go. Finally. Uh, like you see, uh, they've comply and they open the doors for you. They put their hands up. Um... Bobby over here disappeared. I don't know why that happened. And you're basically inside of the bank. Uh, cops will, of course, get their alert. And you you have access to the safe. Uh, what you want to do if you have access to the safe, you just want to load the cash that you're collecting. And now you want to make sure you stay within the vault for at least uh, the remaining seconds. Uh, if you exit the vault, it's literally if you exit this door right here. Uh, you just left the vault and you failed the bank robbery. And, well, that's basically it. Uh, of course, do keep in mind that on the real server, of course, police will be responding and you'll be down here. Maybe bang, bang, whatever, shoot everybody up. Uh, it's just whatever is the case. Um, what then happens, if you're done, uh, you'll get given some cash. It's between 60 and 75k, I, be I believe. It's all randomized. Um, what you then get is this bag that's attached to your bag. Uh, in 30 seconds, uh, Bobby will appear again. And what you now just do is you run. You run, you get out of here, you get out. Uh, the bell stopped, by the way, because we were 60 uh, seconds later um, after we initiated the robbery. Um, this bag will disappear in two minutes. And, well, that's basically bank robbery system number one. But number two is a bit more spectacular, uh, <laughs> if you believe me. All right, so option two is a bit more spectacular, like I said. Um, if you've watched my previous video, you know what this place is. It's a gym shack, the place where you deliver your illegal guns and buy your illegal guns. But gym has something new in stock, and you might want to use it when you rob the bank. But, you know, that's up to you. So there's gym shop, and you see he has explosives. They cost $10,000 each, and you kind of need two because there's two doors. I kind of spoiled it now, but 
you get the gist of it. This costs Jim five products, uh, which means for one explosive, you have to do the smuggle job at least three times successfully. And then you're able to buy explosives. So they're really, really, really rare, rare dude, English. Um, we're just going to buy two and you already see Jim kind of spoiling it. Uh, what are you going to do? Rob bank. And yes, that is what I'm going to do. Um, I'll see you guys at the bank again and I'll, you'll see what's going to happen. All right, so imagine yourself, you're going to be running up with your squad, you're all hyped up, you have your explosives in your bag, and you're just going to run up to the door, and you're going to type slash blow door. What this is going to do is it's going to spawn an explosive on the door, and everybody will put their hands up, of course, because they know what's going down. You know what's going down. Uh, the explosive takes 15 seconds. You have to wait 15 seconds, and then it goes boom, and you'll see what happens. Well this happens <laughs> all right um let's go uh on to door two uh, same principle uh, you need one explosive for each door uh explosive gets on wait 15 seconds and it'll explode uh of course the bells ring again because well bang robbery whoop whoop and please go boom all right uh it it says error bobby because i had to test something with scripting and it, 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 don't mind it uh, same principle again, load cash, uh, wait 30 seconds and you'll get the money. Uh, for this time, because we already saw what happens if you successfully do it, we're just gonna fail robbing the bank. We're just gonna be, oh no, I'm gonna leave. You've left the vault and uh, failed the robbery. The timer still keeps going. My bad, I'll fix that later on. Uh, bell is still going, but you just leave the place. And you're like, oh, I failed the bank robbery, but I'm out. So have a good one, guys. So um, that's basically it. That's my bank robbery suit. I worked on it for quite some time. Um, I could show you something else, actually. Uh, what is also part of the bank robbery script. Um, I hope that Billy Bob Jr. is still not here because then the business will be closed. But, oh wait, I actually have to reset the business. Reset biz 7. All right, the bell is, uh, yeah, it stopped. All right. Um, there's one more command for the PD, uh, which is slash door. Uh, it opens a, a message to all the uh, police. Uh, the Bayside Bank security has been opened by Louis Gomez. Um, same for the bank. You can open it. Uh, the Bayside Bank vault door has been opened by Louis Gomez. Um, you can also close it again, of course. And you can close it again. Uh, what you need in order to do this, uh, you need leader perms in the police department. Uh, if you don't have leader perms, you cannot open this door. And uh, it gives out a message because you're RP using like a card to open the door. So, uh, of course, they would know who opened the door and what happened. Um, so that's my bank robbery script. Um, I hope you guys like it. I certainly really like it. I think it's awesome. I've worked very, very hard on it. Um, if you enjoyed the script, let me know. If you think uh, anything has needs to be changed, let me know as well. I'm interested in, uh, interested in your guys' opinion. Um, that's it for today, though. Um, I hope you like it, and maybe I'll see you on CERP one day. Have a good one.